They may look like small houseflies, but don't be fooled. It is the season for black flies and they can be quite the menace, biting people, drawing blood and catching some by surprise. KXLY Force Anusha Roy joins us live in Spokane. So Anusha, how worried are people? Well, Robin, when somebody finds a bug bite on their body, that too along with blood, well, they're not exactly thrilled by it. Now, Spokane Health District has been getting more and more calls about these biting flies, which they think are black flies. And while it looks like a spectacular view out here on the Spokane River, these flies actually breed in fast water and could be making the situation a little worse. They may be small. I would say in between a sixteenth of an inch to an eighth of an inch. But the bites are big. Yesterday it wasn't a bad, but today it, it's gotten big and it itches like crazy. Their name, black flies or buffalo gnats. They're known for being annoying. Yeah, right on the back of my head here. Drawing blood and scaring a few people. It injects a little bit of um, anticoagulant, which is the same thing like people take as a blood thinner. And um, so then after they bit you, then you have blood running down. Cheryl Sampson is a Central Valley School District nurse. She's gotten a call from almost every school about these gnats. The flies draw blood for food, a lot of times biting around the ear, scalp, and neck. I will be watching. I notice there are a lot of more bugs in my yard. The Spokane Health District says in Washington, the flies don't transmit diseases to humans, but they certainly are a nuisance. Here's a couple right here. Can you see them? It's the season for these small black menaces, according to Raymond Vanderloo in pest control. He says it's a little worse than usual because of the wet spring. Flooding doesn't help. These black flies do breed in uh, fast moving water. Making sure your window and door screens are intact is important, as well as wearing long sleeved light clothing. And just hope this season for these blood suckers passes quickly. Until yesterday, I really hadn't thought we had a black, black flies of any sort here at all. Now you want to try to avoid the flies when they're the most active. That's especially during dawn and dusk. If you do have one of those bites, the school nurse says you can try and treat it with calamine lotion and cortisone cream. The pest control expert that we talked to says, well, these flies could be around for a while. Season usually lasts till about early July. Live in Spokane, Anusha Roy, KXLY4 HD News.